Okay, everybody, get a pencil and paper, take notes. I'm gonna help you to legally cheat the SAT and ACT. Did you guys know that on many of the test questions, they actually give you the answer? Let's look at this problem. So if we apply the C and cheat, which is to make connections and conclusions about the equations they give us before we get into any wording or what the question is, we first quickly observe that these are two lines. And I also notice that these guys think that they're tricky and they switch the X and the Y on me. So we have two lines, we have a system of lines, and I notice that the X and the Y have changed positions in the second equation. So if I want to use a linear combination or elimination, I can do it, but I still have to be careful to make sure I line up my X's and my Y's. Or we could just cheat and we can think to ourselves, wait a minute, they asked me what's the solution and then these idiots gave me the answer. I'm gonna test the values they gave me. Let's go plug in two comma two for the X and Y values and let's see if that works. If it does work for both lines, then that's the answer. We notice that two, two works for the first line, but it doesn't work for the second. So that is not a solution because it has to work for both. So now let's just move through the other options because these idiots gave us the answer. And we find out that the only one that works for both lines is negative two comma negative four. And so there you go. Easy money. Remember, it's all about picking the low-lying fruit. Hey everybody, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, and hit the notification bell so you don't miss the next video on how to become a better cheater.